Hello. Hi, this is Kyle Horst. I'm going to do another Google Sites walkthrough. This session is going to be based on the horizontal navigation bar. Now, while you might be familiar with this um, from past usage, it has changed here lately, and I'm here to show you uh, how to manage the margins and the alignment uh, options that are now available for uh, the horizontal navigation bar. So that's what this is here with. I have several links here at the top. And if we go into the more and edit site layout mode, you can see what I mean, what I have so far. Uh, I have the horizontal navigation enabled. If I click on it, you can see that I have one, two, three, six links here. And I don't have any like spacers built into this. So what Google has done is they've created a, an allotment of, uh, or an option for margins between links. Because they can start to look kind of a little bit crammed here at first, we might want to spread those out along the uh, complete um, space of the horizontal navigation bar. So let's explore that. If we close this, we're going to have to go to the Manage Site area. And we'll have to go to Themes, Colors, and Fonts. Herein, you'll have to go to the horizontal navigation options. We're given another uh, set of options here. Uh, one we're going to be focusing on today is kind of new. It's this layout option. So we have alignment. Uh, by default, it's set to left, but we can center links or right align them. That can be helpful to right align them if you have a logo here in the top left or a background that kind of has a logo. Uh, integrated into it. So that can be a nice uh, treatment for certain websites. Um, let's explore here the left alignment. And you can see I already had 15 pixels in between each um, each link, but here's here's what it would be by default. You can see it's, it's rather crammed. So we want to add a margin of pixels between each link. So let's go with 20 and see how that uh, spaces things out. 20 is a bit difficult. Let's go with uh, 30. And you can see 30 has almost made it across the entire width. 40 definitely is there with this number of links and with this site layout that I'm using, or the site width. So let's go with 40. And one thing to take note of is it's going to bring you 40 pixels away on the left margin. Uh, so, so in this case, it'd be left of home or to the right of contact. So be careful that when you're working on your design uh, that it doesn't interfere with that by creating this uneven spacing. Maybe with your logo, you may want it to be flush with the logo. So that's just a brief uh, overview then of this new feature with Google Sites, that of the margins and alignment of the horizontal navigation bar. Thanks for tuning in, and please leave your comments, and we can definitely respond to those and uh, help you guys out with your new uh, Google Sites. Thank you.